Boca Raton, Florida, a wealthy community filled with stately homes, luxurious golf courses, and miles of picturesque beaches. It's this good life that attracted Cece and her family to move here from New York 10 years ago. I'm thinking. Her father, a former pizzeria owner, helped Cece open Anna Vincenzo's in 2001. My father gave me over $300,000 to open up Anna Vincenzo's. My father's been in the restaurant business since before I was born, and I've always been around the kitchen since I was a baby. OK, pumpkin, bye. I love you. Now Cece is raising her own family, along with her husband, and facing the challenging demands of being owner and head chef of Anna Vincenzo's. Welcome to Anna Vincenzo's. How are you tonight? Two veal piccadas, please. I'm a self-taught cook. Veal marsala, cuatro formaggia. I don't think there's any rules in cooking. My menu, I cook what I like. Chicken marsala, padrino, snapper, Anna. I am passionate about what I do. Can you tell Michael to pick up his fucking calamari wherever they go? After I opened, business was insane. It was fun to come to work. The adrenaline's going, and it's, it's fun. It's great. And you make money. Some more lasagna? Oh, no, thanks. No? About two years ago, it started to change. Let's see, everything that you could possibly think of went wrong is gone wrong. I don't really know why or what happened. That looks like shit. When it's slow that I don't even want to come here. I've lost my desire to come. I don't know how to cook snapper. Maybe it's not cooked enough. To be honest, I got to say, CC probably the biggest reason why we're having trouble right now. OK, forget it. Let's go to another fucking table. She never really cares what's going on. Why is this still here? Table 42. She'll serve crap to a table. <laughs> when she gets mad, she's aggressive and angry. Here's your fuck. Don't let everybody fucking go home. I'm shutting the place down. Yeah, CC has to be hurting now that the business is going bad. There's no customers left. I don't know what happened to them. Where did they go? As of right now, I, I'm in debt about 190000 to my father. I stay up at night just thinking, how am I going to give him his money? There's like nobody fucking coming here. And five tables we have, and everything's fucked up. So hard to see my daughter lose money every day because Sissy works so hard. It is very stressful and very difficult for Cece. Now that we have a son, the restaurant has to work for our personal lives just, just to even live. I'm a failure. I'm afraid we're gonna lose our house. I always tell Michael, I'm afraid we're not gonna be able to feed the baby. Hi. Hey. I have like a weight on my shoulders that, you know, weighs a thousand pounds. And that kills me. Oh my God. Chef Ramsay's my last hope. <laughs>